I was part of the group doing the um, mixed race segment and uh, we started looking at some demographic data but it became clear that the story needed to be told through individuals personal stories so uh, the way into that was to report on communities in our area um, I reported on the city of Columbia Maryland which is right outside of College Park and uh, growing up around here I never thought of Columbia as any kind of case study of anything um, but conveniently uh, it was 40 minutes away and it has a long tradition of um, interracial families and um, has a very high mixed race population. So I started my reporting there. And uh, Columbia is also interesting because it was founded um, by Jim Rouse back in 1968, uh, which was a pretty tumultuous time uh, for race relations in the United States. But he founded the town with an understanding that um, political divisions, economic divisions, and racial divisions uh, could be minimized by creating a diverse community. Um, so I talked to a lot of the old timers from Columbia and also um, some new transplants about whether or not Rouse's vision uh, actually came to fruition and uh, the sort of ways that the community was changing now uh, with more foreign born people uh, moving into the area and also um, changing the face of that community. Uh, telling the story of Columbia took a lot of on the ground reporting. I went back and forth several times um, and every time kind of met more people who remembered more things or could direct me to more sources. Um, and one of the uh, most interesting things about the reporting process was just learning to listen to people, to let them talk, uh, to take their memories down and kind of put it in the context of the demographic information and research that I already had. Um, and their personal stories of, of living in that integrated community over the past 40 years um, really bore out some of the research that we were digging up. So I hope that was um, a good way to sort of bring alive uh, what our section was trying to do.